I can see some bat guano that's, that's uh, laying up there on the roof. So that's uh, probably a main access there. Today, Video Max is here with Jim Kelly, alias Batman. Now, he's not Batman the superhero. Instead, Jim catches the furry winged creatures better known as bats. So hang with us as he takes us on a hair-raising, ladder-climbing trip into the world of these funny winged creatures better known as bats. What we're going to do is going to go up and catch these three bats that are hanging up there, and hopefully they're going to be cooperative and I can snarf on all three of them at once. If not, we're going to have bats flying. <coughs> Hang on a minute. Okay. All right, we just caught three bats up there and you've already taken a look at them. Okay, I want you to see his canines here. We don't want to hurt this guy at all, but we want to check him out, make sure now, notice how I'm back behind his ears because I don't want anything to happen to this guy. As you can see, Jim isn't your average bat exterminator. He takes great care not to hurt the bats he catches, because to him, catching bats is more than just a job, it's a hobby. And if you don't believe me, just check out his basement. When I first, first got into being Batman, I needed a wastebasket down here, and there was a nice wastebasket that had Batman on it by his car. So I picked it up out of the half price store. I thought this would be great, and I thought, I don't want to put garbage in this. I can't do this. So the first thing, you know, I picked a few more items up and I picked up something. So I was sneaking this stuff in the house, you know. <laughs> you name it, I probably got it. Now a lot of this stuff, now a lot of this stuff that I've got is, some's new, some's old. The older stuff is harder to get a hold of. Here's a Batman poster that my son had up in his room. I've got one of these, but yeah. So as you can see, Jim Kelly has a bat cave of his own. In Des Moines, for Video Max, I'm Carlos Kirby.